Eagles Cowboys this Sunday night in Dallas. Let's go. Welcome to the channel where I'm talking all things Philadelphia Eagles, New York Yankees, New Jersey Devils, and Rutgers Scarlet Knights. Like the video and subscribe to the channel. All right, what's going on, everybody? Eagles fans, how we doing? Travis Lonix here to talk Eagles Cowboys this Sunday night coming up in Dallas, AT&T Stadium. Here we go, huge game, Sunday night football. Build off Eagles taking on the Dallas Cowboys. Eagles coming in 10-2, Cowboys 9-3. Absolutely humongous game taking place in Dallas Sunday night. Uh, huge rivalry, Eagles, Cowboys. Both teams hate each other, both teams having really good years. Uh, one team coming off a win, one team coming off a loss. One game separates these two teams. Um, Eagles beat them. A few weeks ago at the link, a real good game. Uh, Cowboys out the birds and uh, a lot of stats won, but the Eagles found a way to keep Dallas out of the end zone and off the scoreboard enough to win that game at the end, pull out the victory. So 10-2 birds, 9-3 Cowboys. The Eagles coming off tough, uh, rough 42-19 loss to San Francisco 49ers this past Sunday at the link. Uh, rematch of the NFC Championship game. Niners obviously... We're ready for this game. There's their revenge game. Got to get back game to the Eagles. Obviously, last year, losing Brock Purdy in that game and then losing the game bad to the Birds. They were ready. Uh, they played a great game, and they took it down, and then took it to our, our Philadelphia Eagles. Uh, no question about it. Well, props to them. Uh, Eagles started out good drives, but set up a few goals. Defense, nice couple drives early, and then this allowed during the game a six straight touchdown drives to them Niners. Brock Purdy, real good game. They had a lot of weapons, and they outplayed the Eagles. 42-19. Not what you want, but it's one game for the Birds. Cowboys on the, on the, on the uh, other end of the stick. 9-3. Cowboys are 9-3. Coming off a 41-35 win at home versus Seattle Seahawks um, this past, or last Thursday. So they've had, they've had about 10 days so to prepare for the Birds. And yeah, 41-35. It was a game back and forth. Seattle led a good amount of the game. Dallas came back, real high score, obviously. And Seattle still had a chance late. Um, question, questionable calls by McCarthy to go for it. But Dallas defense preserves, prevails at the end. And they, get, they, they uh, do get the win over Seattle, 41-35. So the defense sharded their offense, who has been great, especially at home, scoring 30 or 40-plus points in a crazy amount of games. Uh, this season, they've won, I think, 14 straight home games. AT&T Stadium, they play very, very well at home, and they're a great team overall. So, I mean, looking at this game, it's, it's huge. A humongous, obviously, one game separates the Eagles and Cowboys in the division. The Eagles still hold one-game lead in whole NFC Conference. So, it's it's massive, massive, massive. And um, Gale Hurts and the Eagles offense, if you're going to get Dallas Goddard back, uh, it seems like, which will be great. Uh, AJ Brown's as a team uh, wasn't really too ready to go enough, I guess, focus. Uh, intensity, toughness wasn't really there against the Niners. Said they'd be ready to go against Dallas, and uh, I believe him. Uh, offense didn't play better. Uh, it was kind of tough the way the defense was getting shredded there most of the game, but they got it. They canceled out field goals, uh, good touchdowns. Brian Johnson got to be better calling the plays. Hurts got to be better. Can't take sacks. Don't want him standing around forever. Throw to somebody, throw the ball away. Don't take sacks. Can't turn the ball over. Get that run game going. Get that run game going. We had a guy standing outside the Novacare complex holding signs, running the ball. Get it going. Get the run game going. Mix in the pass and uh, score some points because you're probably going to have to score a lot of points. Go toe-to-toe -to -toe with these Dallas Cowboys. Lead us to the Cowboys offense. Again, led by Dak Prescott having a great year. Um, CeeDee Lamb and all those guys on that that offense are really, really good. A lot of weapons and uh, put up a lot of points. I mean, tough to defend. Again, last time in Philly, they put up a lot of yards and everything. Dak played real well, but they didn't put up, put, a lot, put up a lot of points. They were close, close, scoring touch, more touchdowns, close to getting a two-point conversion, but birds prevailed, prevailed. And um, so this time around, uh, in their place, we're going to score a lot of points, execute really well on offense. Uh, it's going to be a battle, and um, it should be a heck of a game. I'm going to say Dallas is going to win this game. I'm going to say 31-27. I think the Birds will be played better. I mean, you gotta you got to tackle better. You can't. Um, a, lot of, a lot of missed tackles they had against the Niners. Having, um, having Shaq Leonard out there, linebackers should be real help. 
Uh, even if he plays a little bit, definitely be a big, big help and boost for the Eagles defense. But overall, guys, uh, get pressure on Dak, stop that run, and just uh, keep, keep, keep the plays in front of you and tackle better and just so, as a whole execute better. Sunday night against Dallas will, will lead to a win. I'm going to say Dallas again. We'll pull it out 31 27. But uh, that's what I got. And uh, again, it should be one heck of a game. Eagles, Cowboys, Sunday night football. Let's go. Let's go. Can't wait for the game. If you guys are pumped for the game, like the video up. If you like my video here, like it up. Drop a comment about your thoughts on this game. Have a good one. Let's go, birds.